welcome back to another episode and in today's video it was absolute craziness this is the coolest video I'll probably ever make I'm so excited to show you this but before we start I get all my gear except the spreader bars from the Avon hodgepodge I'll link that down below and I also link the spreader bars down below in case you guys want to pick some up yourself um, lately we've had the purple and the zucchini have been working the best less talking more doing I'll jump right into this video we left the dock around 4 o'clock and we were blowing up the inlet and originally we didn't think we were going to be able to make it out to the canyon but as we went along it really flattened out and it got beautiful so we pushed on, we were probably doing about 30 knots and eventually we saw dolphins and birds working so we stopped and we put we just put three lines out, two spreader bars and I rigged up a ballyhoo uh, once we did that we got the lines out, we stopped that's when we hooked up to the first fish Freaking spreader bar? Yeah, it's not to come over here. I'm coming, I'm turning the boat this way. Drive here. Okay. Did your GoPro one time? gaffed them up, brought them in. Um, beautiful fish, 35 pound yellow fin. A little small, but a really good size for my first ever tuna. Um, and then it kind of got slow for a little bit. We didn't see a lot of light life. Um, the dolphins kind of went down. Um, and then we saw them again. We started following them, and they led us to a lump. Um, if you're familiar with 30 fathom tuna lump, that's where we were. Uh, they led us. That's where the dolphins led us to. There was whales, birds. The dolphins were there. We saw tons of life, and that's when we hooked up to the second fish. Now this was an absolute monster elephant. Is it big? Try get it on. Start getting these lines in. Oh yeah. We gotta get these lines. These ones. What? We got the bow heel all the way out there, and we got this. Yeah, just Line, Jesus, took out a lot of line. He's 
He's not ready. He's not ready. Yes. Get him. So again, we gaffed the fish, brought him in, took some pictures, and that was a stud yellowfin, around 60 pounds. He lost, that one lost a lot of blood, so uh, by the time we weighed him in, he was 58. He was probably about 63 pounds, 64 pounds when uh, we initially caught him, so that was a really big fish, and we kept going around. Uh, we trolled around for another like hour or two, and then... We turned around and saw a massive fin in our spread and realized that we were about to be in for about an hour fight with a mako shark. I got it. You're doing it? Alright, listen. I'm gonna... You, you reel? Let's put it in. Hey, look. Reel. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like, hit the like button and subscribe. Turn on the post notifications bell for more content. And hope you guys liked that video. It was probably the craziest one I'll ever make. That Mako jumping out of the water. I don't think I've ever seen anything like it. Um, it was a great experience for me. And hopefully I can share that with you guys. Hope you guys liked the video. Again, hit the like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications. And until next time, peace.